Morning everybody, nice to see you all. So welcome to Penniston Grammar School, our class of 2026. How exciting. So this is us. This is our wonderful transition team. So you can see Mr. Crook Claire, the principal, myself, um, I'm assistant principal and transition lead. You have then got the wonderful Mr. Squires, who will be your achievement leader. So he's like the head teacher for year seven and will stay with you all the way through to year 11 with us. You are also very fortunate. You've got the wonderful Mrs. Tomlin, who will be your dedicated student support officer. And then you can see our lovely Mrs. Smith, who is our Senka, our special educational needs coordinator. So at Penniston Grammar, we have five core values. We live by these, this is the staff and the students, and every member of our learning community who follows these core values. Aim high. We want you to fulfil your destiny. We want you to aim high, reach for the stars. We will support you with that no matter what your goal is. We will help you to reach it. Be determined. Okay, we know that anything worth doing is going to take a lot of effort, but be determined, okay? Yes, you will make mistakes. You will absolutely sometimes fail famous failures, okay? But that's okay. That's how you will succeed in the long run. We want you to be brave. Okay, transitions are really scary time for some people. It's nerve wracking. But you know what? Sometimes it is necessary to feel a little bit nervous because that's where bravery comes into play. And the rewards are often great when you do this. Be supportive. Okay, we are a school full of supportive um, people who care for each other and you're in a really supportive community when you come to us at Penniston Grammar School. And uh, last but not least, we want you to feel proud, okay? When you come to us and you've got your fantastic blazer on with your emblem on here, um, on your school blazer, we want you to wear it with pride. You are one of 320 students coming to us, and we've got about a further 50 on a waiting list, so please feel proud to be coming to us at Penniston. Okay, so Year 6, um, we have a dedicated student transition website for you to visit at any point. This is dedicated to you. It has everything on there that you will need to know. If you go into Google and type in Penniston Grammar School Transition, all of these wonderful videos and all these different tabs will, will come onto the screen and hopefully support you with your transition journey. Planners. So you will get your glossy planning when you come to us in September. In the meantime, you will get issued with a temporary planner when you come to us on your transition days. Um, so your planners are used to collect merits and commendations and lots of rewards. Um, there's also space in your plans to write down any of your home learning, which you might get from us at Penniston Grammar School. And, and also there are some um, parts here, what you can see, where we might write down some lines to remind you about your efforts, to remind you about your behaviour. But I'm sure that all of you Year 6s are absolutely superbly behaved, so we don't need to worry too much about them. Instead, I'd like us to focus on getting lots of merits and lots of rewards from those merits that you get. So standards of effort Year 6. I have heard from your teachers, your Year 6 teachers and head teachers in your primary school that you have, are coming to us with a really high standard of effort, which is fantastic and what we like to hear. So we won't give you any grades when you come to us in year seven. Instead, we will send home reports and talk to you about your level of effort. We are always aiming for effort level four and effort level five. So good effort and excellent effort. OK, so thinking about those core values, being resilient, facing new challenges, acting upon feedback and of course, coming in looking presentable and um, having your equipment ready and of course, completing your homework. So you can see on this slide here the kind of things that we are looking for. Okay, so expectations for presentation. So when you come to us in every lesson, you're going to need the basic equipment. You can see that list here. It's available on the website as well. All of these things, very simple. You can get them from our school shop. You can get them from Asda, any big supermarket. You can go somewhere fancy like Paper Chase or anywhere like that, as long as you have all of this equipment. We expect that you are organised when you come to us. Come to us, you have your planner out and open on the desk with your equipment out and ready in front of you. We always um, expect excellent presentation in terms of your handwriting, so the date in full, underline with a ruler, capital letters, etc. And we do hope that you act on teacher feedback. You'll notice when you come to us, teachers will write things uh, in your books, on your work, 
The reason they do that and give you all these different codes is for you to act upon that feedback to make you the most effective, effective version of yourself. So we've got our wonderful uniform here. Um, every member of Penniston Grammar School is expected to look smart, um, so we feel equal, so we feel like we're ready for learning. We expect you to wear a smart blazer. You'll also um, be given a tie and a tie colour depending on what house you're in. We expect you to wear a white shirt, short sleeved or long sleeved, black trousers, shiny black shoes, no trainers guys, um, or a black skirt as well. So this is the plan of our wonderful school. Um, it's a fantastic building. It's all colour coded to help you. So when you get your timetables year six, what we always advise that you do is colour it in to match the different colour of that area in the building. So you can have a look at this slide at your leisure. You can see we've got a wonderful PE department here in orange where we have the state of the art gym, the sports hall, the trampolines. We've got the wonderful AstroTurf, the trim trail, the basketball courts, etc. You've got really great PE facilities. We've got our teal department here where our lovely heart space is. We've got maths, English and business in blue. We have our green, um, green department, which is science, art, technology and languages. And we've also got our purple department, which is history and geography and, of course, religious and citizenship studies. So this is what we call our humanities department. So please, please uh, do come and look around the building when you come to us on your transition days. You'll also get to visit our wonderful new library. So exciting times ahead of you. So when you get your planner, you will notice on your planner there are lots of different codes on there. For example, if we take this one, TE406, we break it down. So the first part of that code tells you the two letters of the subject you are going into. So TE, technology. The middle part before the decimal point tells you which level you are going to. So technology, level four. And the latter part after the decimal point tells you which room you're in on that floor. So this one will be technology, level floor, room six. Okay. You can have a little look at this in your own time. If you just try and guess which department this is and which room they're in, I will help you in preparation for coming to us on your transition days and team building afternoons if you are joining us for them. So here is an example of your timetable. At Penniston Grammar School, we have a week A and a week B. So on week A here, if we look uh, down at a Monday, there'll be five periods in your day, including your lunch and of course your morning break. An example of a traditional Monday would be maths, science, languages, lunch, PE and religious education. You've also got these codes here. These code year six symbolise which teacher you will have. So LWR here, Mrs. Lisa Wilson and of course the room you will be going to. So whilst the school day finishes at 10 to 3, you can continue being determined, being supportive by participating in our enrichment um, after school activities or during the day as well. We have a wonderful repertoire of enrichment activities. We have football, fitness, club size, basketball, science catch up, club, um, club band, rock band, also choir, loads of different things for you to get involved in please, please do get involved in them. There's no need to sign up. Just turn up on the day, go for the hour. I'm sure that you will love the activities, but don't worry, guys, if you don't, you don't need to go to that activity again. Maybe try something different. OK, so key terminology then, key words that we think you might come across when you come to us at Penniston. Enrichment, so after school activities to enrich your um, traditional school life. SSO, your student support office and Mrs. Tomlin. DSL, every school has to have one by law, your designated safeguarding lead, which will look into your inclusion and your pastoral offer when you come to us at Penniston Grammar School. So these key things here, year six, are vital and pivotal to everything you do here at the grammar school. Whilst we absolutely want you to succeed academically, we also want you to succeed pastorally as well. So we want you to feel safe. We want you to feel that you can talk to us, which all of these key people within this team will make sure that you can. And of course, me as head of Heartspace will always ensure you are included too. 
your achievement leader, so that's Mr Squires, who we spoke about earlier, your mentor, so you will all get a class champion who you will meet and greet every morning, who will stay with you through your time at Penniston and check your planners and things like that. Resilience lessons, so when you come to us in year seven, you will get um, myself or another member of our senior leadership team and we teach you a full resilient curriculum where we teach you lots of different life skills. Very, very exciting indeed. Okay, so you will be receiving, hopefully in the next couple of weeks, this transition getting to know you booklet. We've told you all about us. This is for you to tell us all about you. We'd like you to put a picture on there of yourself. Tell us about your friends at primary school or friends who you know in our community. Uh, things you're excited about, potentially things you're nervous about, and anything else on there you think we need to know. So what's next? We have three key transition days, Tuesday the 15th of June, Wednesday the 23rd of June, and Monday the 28th of June. There's a very exciting Harry Potter theme happening throughout these days. Um, and also, for you students who are coming to us individually from our smaller schools, if you're coming on your own without any friends, you will be invited to team building afternoons too. So we're really excited to meet you in year six. In the meantime, if you do have any questions, tweet us. You can follow me on Twitter, Mrs. C at Heartspace PGS, or Penniston Grammar School Transition Twitter, the main school Twitter, or of course you can email our transition inbox and we will endeavour to get back to you very quickly. So that's all from me. Have an amazing half-term holiday and we really are looking forward to seeing you after the break. Take care, year six. Bye.